It's easy to understand how a sailboat can sail downwind. The wind just pushes it. But how can a sailboat sail upwind? You can't sail directly into the wind, or else your sails would just luff like this. If you want to sail upwind, you need to haul the sails in as much as you can, and you can sail about 45 degrees into the direction of the wind. In order to provide lift, we need to have smooth airflow on both sides of the sail. So we have these telltales here that should be streaming straight back. The telltales on the main sail are on the leech, and they should also be streaming straight back. There's a lot to sail trim, and this video just barely touches on it. So for the point of this video, just think of you need smooth airflow on both sides of the sails to provide lift. The high pressure side of the sail is the side of the sail that's closer to the wind. The low pressure side of the sail is the side of the sail that's further away from the wind. Lift is always going to be generated from high to low pressure, but the boat is traveling in this direction. On the bottom of our boat, we have a keel. Let's take our Sea Sprite 28 out of the water to take a look. The keel is our underwater fin. It gives us traction, keeps us from sliding sideways, has quite a bit of ballast in it to keep the boat from flipping over. It counteracts the forces on the sails, but it's a lot smaller than the sails because water is so much denser than air. And it also provides quite a bit of lift. Let's take a look. The keel is preventing us from slipping sideways through the water. So we have a low pressure side of the keel and a high pressure side of the keel. But it's the opposite of the pressure in the sails. So the lift created from the keel is in the opposite direction as the lift created from the sails. Here's another way to think about the lift with the sails. If we think of a sailboat like an airplane, lay it on its side. Just think of the sails like airplane wings. Nice smooth flow over both sides of the sail, providing lift. Our keel is our other wing. It's a sailboat, so we don't need uh, we don't need an airplane wing on either side. And then the keel is going to also provide lift. We take our boat that's on its side, flip it back up, put it in the water. We have our wind coming from this direction, flowing nicely over both sides of the sails. This is the high pressure side of the sails. It has to be. The wind is leaning the boat over in that direction. There's more wind pressure on this side of the sails. Here's an H for the high pressure side of the sails. This is the low pressure side of the sails here. So here's an L for low pressure. If we take our keel off, toss it aside, we'd have nothing to give us some traction in the water. We would just skid sideways through the water. Put the keel back on. This is the high pressure side of the keel. Water pressure pressing against that side of the keel. So we put an H there for the high pressure side. And then this is the low pressure side of the keel. Lift is always generated from high to low pressure. So the high pressure side of the sails is creating lift in this direction. This is a lift from the sails. This is the high pressure side of the keel here, going to the low pressure side. So the lift from the keel is in this direction. These two forces are going to combine, and our boat direction is going to be this way, through the water, about 45 degrees from the direction of the wind, as we're sailing upwind. That's a lot of information. Let's take a look at this clip and review it all. This is our wind direction coming down here. We have the low pressure side of the sail, and we have the high pressure side of the sail. Lift is always generated from high pressure to low pressure. So the keel is keeping us from sliding sideways through the water. This is the high pressure side of the keel. The water is pushing against the side of the keel. And our lift from the keel is generated in the opposite direction as it is from the sails. The lift from the keel and the sails combined allow us to sail about 45 degrees from the direction of the wind. There was a lot of different boats in this video from clips from the whole summer. We had a Day 302, a Hunter 32, Catalina 360, Cirrus 21, Sea Sprite 28, and then we ended on an Island Pack at 420. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks.